Pirate Parties International (PPI) is a not-for-profit international non-governmental organization with its headquarters in Brussels, Belgium. Formed in 2010, it serves as a worldwide organization for pirate parties, currently representing members from 42 countries. The pirate parties are political incarnations of the freedom of expression movement, trying to achieve their goals by the means of the established political system rather than through activism. In 2017 PPI had been granted special consultative status to the United Nations Economic and Social Council. Aims The PPI statutes give its purposes as to help establish, to support and promote, and to maintain communication and cooperation between pirate parties around the world. The PPI advocate on the international level for the promotion of the goals its members share such as protection of human rights and fundamental freedoms in the digital age, consumer and authors' rights oriented reform of copyright and related rights, support of information privacy, transparency and free access to information. The name, ''Pirates'' itself is a reappropriation of the title that was given to Internet users by the representatives of the music and film industry, and does not refer to any illegal activity. History The first Pirate Party was the Swedish Pirate Party, founded on 1 January 2006. Other parties and groups were formed in Austria, Canada, Denmark, Finland, Germany, Ireland, the Netherlands, Poland, and Spain. In 2007, representatives of these parties met in Vienna, Austria to form an alliance and plan for the 2009 European Parliament elections. Further conferences were held in 2008 in Berlin and Uppsala, the latter leading to the Uppsala Declaration of a basic platform for the elections. In September 2008, Andrew Norton, United States, was appointed as coordinator of the PPI Collective. In August 2009, he stepped down and passed the function of coordinator over to the core team. Led by Patrick Mackler and Samir Alawi, in 2009, the original Pirate Party won 7.1% of the vote in Sweden's European Parliament elections and won two of Sweden's 20 MEP seats. Inspired by a surge in membership following the trial and conviction of three members of the ideologically aligned Pirate Bay a year earlier, on 18 April 2010, the Pirate Parties International was formally founded in Brussels at the PPI conference from April 16 to 18. The Uppsala Declaration At the 2009 Conference of Pirate Parties International in Uppsala Sweden, European Pirate Parties agreed on a common declaration of the party's goals for the upcoming election of the European Parliament. Central issues of the declaration are Reform of copyright, exemption of noncommercial activity from copyright regulation, reduction of the duration of copyright protections, banning of DRM technologies, opposition to media or hardware levies. Reform of patent law, particularly stating that patents on life, including patents on seeds and on genes, and software should not be allowed. Strengthening civil rights, transparent government, speedy and fair trial, freedom of speech, and expansion of the right to anonymity in communication. The Prague Declaration At 2012 Conference of Pirate Parties International in Prague Czech Republic, European Pirate Parties agreed to run in the elections to the European Parliament in the year 2014 with a common programme as well as establish a European political party. The declaration has been followed by conferences in Potsdam and Barcelona to work on the structure of the legal body to come and the statutes for it. Resignations In February 2015, Pirate Party Australia resigned from PPI due to serious disagreement with the direction and management of the organisation. In the same month, Pirate Party UK also resigned, and in March, the Belgian Pirate Party suspended its membership within PPI. On 20 April 2015, the Pirate Party of Iceland voted overwhelmingly to leave PPI. 
A member of the executive, Arnalder Sigurarsson, reported a 96.56% vote in favor of leaving, adding, PPI has been pretty much useless when it comes to its objectives which should be to encourage international cooperation between pirate parties. In May 2015, the Pirate Party of Sweden resolved with a significant majority to leave PPI, cancelling their observer status. In July 2016, the Pirate Party of Canada officially withdrew from Pirate Party's international, citing ongoing troubles with the organisation as well as a failure to adequately provide any accomplishments over its history. Structure The PPI is governed by a board, formerly led by two co-chairs, and since Warsaw Conference of 2015 by a chair and a vice-chair. Policy, governance, and applications for membership are the responsibility of the PPI General Assembly which must convene at least once per year. By the current rules, board members are elected for a two-year term, half of the board being elected every year. PPI conferences Topic Pirate Party Movement Worldwide See Pirate Party and list of pirate parties for an overview of all pirate parties around the world